World No Tobacco Day is a crucial reminder of the devastating impact of smoking on our health. Tobacco smoking causes at least 20 different types of cancer. But here's the good news. If you quit smoking, your risk of developing many of these cancers decreases significantly. But what about those who are active smokers and have already been diagnosed with cancer? Is it too late for them to quit? In one study, we recruited over 500 patients with lung cancer who were active smokers at the time of diagnosis. We closely monitored them for an average of seven years and found that quitting smoking reduced the risk of death and cancer progression by 30%. But you may wonder, is this benefit only limited to cancers strongly related to tobacco smoking, such as lung cancer? Well, to find out, we conducted another study involving over 200 patients with kidney cancer who were smokers at diagnosis. The results were equally incredible. Quitting smoking after diagnosis cut the risk of death and disease progression by half. It is important to note that these positive effects were not limited to patients with early stage cancers or light smokers. Even those with late stage cancers and heavy smokers at diagnosis experienced significant improvements in cancer survival when they quit. Unfortunately, studies show less than half of cancer patients who smoke are referred to tobacco cessation services. Many physicians don't even discuss smoking cessation with their patients. Why? Mainly due to a lack of knowledge, lack of education, and lack of resources. On this World No Tobacco Day, let's join forces to remove these obstacles and prioritize smoking cessation support as a crucial part of treating patients with cancer who smoke. At the policy-making level, sustainable funding should be dedicated to developing and maintaining tobacco cessation services, including within the oncology units. Also, tobacco cessation training programs should be provided for healthcare professionals. At the physician level, it is crucial for them to assess tobacco use in all patients with cancer and discuss the benefits and strategies for smoking cessation. And to all patients out there, please remember it is never too late to quit smoking. Even after a cancer diagnosis, you have the power to improve your cancer outcomes by quitting. Happy No World Tobacco Day. And remember, together we can make a difference.